Tennessee. Morristown, Tennessee. Uh, this is the lead card at Rotary Disc Golf Course. No. Now we're moving on to hole number one. It's 435. Plays out of bounds during I'm this I'm not 100% sure here. myself. You would think it would. Mm -hmm. So, But he was uh, lucky enough to stay up on the edge. Even if it's not OB, you don't want to be down in that creek. It's usually dry, but you still don't want to be down there. Ooh. Snappy with a huge throw here. Hanging out way out there. <laughs> he goes long past the basket. Snappy problem. <laughs> Snappy. He's a comebacker. Oh. Mm. If he shores that up, a lot of people are in trouble. Mm -hmm. Snappy's got a huge arm. <laughs> 240 foot hole number into the woods. He has almost nothing back there. So I've never seen anybody go there. That's, uh, that's going to be rough to get out of that. Snappy with a great roller. Oh, wow. hits the pin. He's starting shaking his head. To, yeah, starting <laughs> to get to him there. He was making a huge charge for it there. And, oh, good birdie from Snappy there. Yeah. But Colin was making a full of the round four coverage. Uh, it's 307 grass. is kind of thick. He didn't get a whole lot of skip, so he's got some work to do for a two. Snappy going with a forehand as well. Oh, oh, hit the, that's, that's, yeah, you can't let your, your flip go high. Mm -hmm. It happens because you're on elevated, between how low you need to throw that. Definitely. But if you get it right, you see, you've seen the two shots that got it right. Yeah, this hole is definitely one you can walk away with the two on, but you just, uh, you have to hit your line and. <sighs> Snappy looking for a birdie three. Makes it happen. As you can see, Snappy hit pretty much the earliest. Uh, they were starting on hole number one, so. Uh, hole number one. Oh. Absolutely. Now, Snappy here uh, looks like he's lining up a roller, which is something I've never seen on this hole, so we'll see what he can do with this. It sits okay. down. I was wondering if Corey was ready for that. <laughs> Corey's always ready. Huge shout out to Corey Murphy. And that is an excellent shot right Wow. Here. He's looking at about 215 from the other videos. Dutch is an excellent putter, so he shouldn't have any problems with that. Snappy with the longest drive here. This is absolutely the longest drive I've ever seen on this hole. Just a nice toss. Sit down. There you go. Great shot. There is a chance it happen. Snappy here, James Snappy Cole. We actually got to film a uh, pros versus Joe, pro versus Joe's video with him. We had a great time filming with him, and uh, we also switch is really Pretty good. good. Yeah. yeah. Moving on to hole number five. Opinion. Yeah, so. like the perfect drive. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Snappy is going with a roller here, which I don't think uh, I've ever seen any AMs do a roller. Not that I know of. He goes on past the basket. Ooh, he's past hole six is tee pad. <laughs> halfway down the fairway of hole six. So uh, I'm sure he's going to try and run it, but uh, this is thick. Over there. Yeah, it's pretty thick. Snappy's still got, I think, about 120 feet back to the basket. That's wow. a great shot. While I know these guys are probably looking to get a birdie every time on this hole, uh, I think it probably gets in their head a little bit more than they think uh, off the tee. Like I said, 335 feet. But the uphill, only two strokes behind uh, Chris Dickerson. He birdied yeah, how Corey caught that, but he did. <laughs> <laughs> I was mentioning the OB... Uh, there's a net that goes all the way to the top of those large uh, telephone poles you see there. And you'd have to go over that to be OB. So unless they're playing a big, huge hyzer over the right, the OB doesn't really come into play. So I can put him right under the basket and walk away with a three. 
Snappy, I can imagine, is looking to do the same thing. He might be giving it a bit of a run because he's a little closer than what Logan, uh, Logan was. Oh, yeah. Okay. The, the uh, final round of uh, what will get you into the final nine. This is round four for trying to stay up uh, in the top four. Moving on to hole number seven. If that, if you miss that tree, that's going right up there. Yeah, absolutely. No surprise, Snappy's going to be going with a roller as well. It's three out of the first four holes, Snappy went with a roller. He's got a huge arm. And uh, if he didn't hit that tree right there, he just like... Like Snappy's gonna put a little bit of Anheuser. This is a hard. This. this is a hard shot. This is a hard backhand shot. Absolutely. Get in there. He got in there. Wow, wow shot. <laughs> it's a it's a tough angle right there. I've been Colin. He played this hole perfectly. So if you look back at Colin's scores, he's making a huge charge. Mm -hmm. He birdied the first three and then eagled this one. He's looking to win states, guys. He hasn't been a pro for very up at the top. So great charge from Colin there. Moving on and trying to bite off as much as they can in the placement, but they know there's no real way to be aggressive for a two, so really no sense in going for a two. Now, I have heard stories about in years oh. past, uh, Will she used to not be quite as thick. Yeah, That's... I wish I could see that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I would love to have seen that. If anybody's got video of that, maybe Brad Beck does. If anybody's got video of that, I definitely need to see that. Yeah. Snappy came up a little short, hit the early tree that most people do hit when they're flicking. But that's a nice approach. <laughs> Absolutely great shot. For the top and put a putt in for a three. Except like for a, Snappy, he had a longer approach. Yeah, now. yeah, Snappy did have a longer approach. So he's got to feel good about that. Oh, definitely. Uh, Colin and... Chris are still tied at the top. Moving on to hole number. The wood down there, I don't think it would. I didn't think it would be good for a skip. To I be th honest, I think he uh, may he was playing for the skip. Another great shot from Snappy there. He's got a putt. Well, as I was saying, I think Snappy looking for a birdie. Oh. Even though this is a... His birdie there. He absolutely parked it. <laughs> BDGC's Griffith right there walking around with the pro. Didn't realize it did. So that's putting the pressure back on Colin. Uh, Colin was moving his way up the scorecard. And uh, Chris parked it and Colin's got a long putt. So we'll see what he can do. So Chris is going to take the lead back on this hole. Once again, like I said, make sure you check out our uh, BDGC Joes versus the Pro with Snappy. He, we played him down at a course in Virginia and, uh, no, Georgia, I'm sorry. Georgia. Yeah. It was a great course. And uh, he absolutely demolished us. <laughs> yeah. One versus Spoiler five. alert. <laughs> yeah, spoiler alert. Sorry about that. Uh, if you haven't seen it, uh, he actually shot the course record during that round. So make sure you check that out. Good birdie putt right there. That's nice. He, he is uh, one stroke behind him at 33 down for the lead. Shooting a hot round. Yes, so they're fading down. Um, he's got an approach shot, but it's going to be down at the bottom of a hill. Snappy has got a huge arm. As you can see here, I have uh, never <laughs> seen him drive like this on, that, on this hole. What in the world? He didn't even look like he was trying. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a par three. Snappy with absolute best drive I've ever seen on this hole. You're looking at a eagle putt on this hole. That's amazing. a jump putt yeah. on this hole. That's yeah. I, I've always said that as well. It, it's just really hard for Andy to bite off any distance. Hard holes to me. That's just not fun going yeah. up that hill. <laughs> All these guys looking to play the Heiser line, just, uh, I don't know what they're throwing, but I would just could get a fairway driver or a mid, maybe even a mid-range yeah. down there. Yeah. 
Snatch cam on that, so he's more than likely in the woods there. It's it's very thick in there. Snappy, just as you can see there, these guys. Even if you hit the tr numerous times, so it's it's not uh, it's not impossible to get a four on this, but they try and make it into the final nine, so uh, they got to make something. <clears throat> Here we've got in of a sponsor, James Snappy Cole. Such a great guy. and uh, He definitely arm. has the arm to oh, try yeah. to go over top. Absolutely. That's what I was saying. He's got a huge arm. so No surprise that he's going to a huge hyzer shot. He makes it in. Hopefully he can. Logan with a nice uh, Anheuser shot. Just lay it up there. Snappy's got a good shot at this. It's a it's a little bit further than it looks mm -hmm. with this camera in it. It definitely is. This looks a lot closer than it actually is. You can tell by how long it was in the air there. But uh, besides seeing somebody do the hyzer over the top, I've never seen anybody get in that close for a two. There's not a lot of twos happen on this hole. Start of, uh, at least at the start of this back nine. We've got a lot of the two. The, uh, there's no easy feed right there. Dickerson made that look a whole lot easier. Yeah, these guys are making it look easier. If you could see from the tee pad what this shot looks like, it just doesn't look like you're going to be able to get your disc to come back on a, that, on a flex. Kind of a snappy with a backhand as well. Oh, mm, that's the danger. Yeah, it's rough on that uh, left the inbounds there. Snappy looking at about nothing over here on the left side. Yeah, he he's took a minute. Around. He took a minute on this one. Yeah, he's looking at his options, and there's not a whole lot. Looks like he's going with a forehand roller to get out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and that will definitely work. Just yeah, messing with him weird a little bit. Weird footing, and it looked like stuff was laying on his back. So I know that always gets me if I'm uh, backed up against the woods like that. Oh, oh, oh he hit center pole. Hated to see that after Snappy taking a bogey four on this one. Surprised he just other way. They shouldn't have done that. <laughs> so it looks like Colin actually did go out of bounds there. He got a bogey hit tournament. Mm, no. These are the the best pros in and around Tennessee area. You know, Dutch from Kentucky. Uh, a lot of players coming. Like I said, a lot of the scoring opportunities are gone. You saw there, uh, as we said, uh, just, you know, none of these pros made it up to the basket. And like I said, these are some of the best pros, the best pros in the area. So it looks like uh, everybody's going to be walking away with uh, par or worse on this hole. So Definitely, if you get this hole into, if you get this a birdie on this one, you're definitely gaining a stroke. On, on a large percentage yeah. of the field. A three-stroke lead. Um, not that many uh, holes. Uh, he's he's uh, on the left side, but uh, he's up there quite a bit. Snappy has a huge arm, so we'll see what he can do. He got through those trees. Yeah, that's a good shot right there. Good run. I loved being able to film Colin during this tournament. Uh, such a great guy, and uh, he has so much ahead of him. I can't mm -hmm. wait to see the future. The toughest guy is to play against, and he's second. Uh, yeah. Uh, you you got to figure these are the guys, uh, Snappy, Logan, Dutch. These guys play the lead as we move into hole number 17. It's a 310 feet dog leg, I can tell you that. That's a great shot from Dutch. Snappy looking like he's going to take a forehand roller mm -hmm. as well. This is the hole that Snappy let me pick while he threw on the 2016 Tennessee State coverage. Not a fairway, but uh, he's got a long putt from there. Snappy got caught up a bit early. You can see this fairway there. The air shot's just too risky this late in the tournament. Hmm.
Yeah, it's the problem with this hole, if you don't make it at least through that gap, that straight gap, you got a lot of stuff in your way. Absolutely. Oh, good run there from Snappy. Snappy taking a four on this one. Like we said, that fairway is not very forgiving. No, but... Mm -hmm. Moving on to hole 18, it's the 540. Uh, man can only dream. <laughs> Goodness. Snappy, as we've said in the other video, is a huge arm. Didn't even look like he was trying there. And that is looking like an absolute crush. Oh, Almost skips in. Goodness. Almost skipped in for an ace on a 540 foot hole around this area. Making East Tennessee very proud. Oh, yeah. So is Snappy. Yeah, absolutely. Great eagle from uh, Snappy. Oh, I'm just so dynamic. On another latitude, they can't stand it. Yeah, I'm a rocket boy. I stay blasting off, and I was never planning on landing. Been working on my legacy yeah. since I've been a prodigy. It's probably the dog in me. I mean, honestly, ain't no one stopping me. No apologies. I'm so astonishing. I say, Innova, yeah, I've been the one. We talking trophies, dog, give me them. Championships, I'ma give me some, and I'ma keep on grinding till the millions come.